Some scientists call it the Earth's heartbeat. But why is the Earth's human resonance accelerating? Kathy Forty, author of Fractals of God, reports the ancient Indian rishis called 7.83 hertz the frequency of Om. It also happens to be Mother Earth's natural heartbeat rhythm known as the Schumann Resonance. And according to Wikipedia, Schumann Resonances are global electromagnetic resonances excited by lightning discharges in the cavity formed by the Earth's surface and the ionosphere. For many years, this resonance frequency has hovered at a steady 7.83 Hz with only slight variations. In June 2014, it apparently changed. Monitors at the Russian Space Observatory system showed a sudden spike in activity to up to 8.5 Hz. And since then, they've recorded days where the Schumann accelerated as fast as 16.5 Hz. The graph is usually blue with some green and no white. At first, they thought their equipment was malfunctioning, but later learned the data was accurate. Everyone was asking, what's causing this intermittent spiking activity? So the, the, uh, you can see the white there. Okay. Now, uh, always, some of it, sometimes it goes up to 24. Now, as, is the Earth's frequency speeding up? Since the Schumann frequency is said to be in tune with human brain's alpha and theta states, this acceleration may be why it often feels like times has sped up and events and change in our life are happening more rapidly. But how is that possible? Now, these emerging resonances are naturally correlated to human brain wave activity. Kindly support my Patreon account since YouTube has again demonetized my YouTube channel. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below. So this means we are changing. Many years ago I was trained in EEG neurofeedback so I looked at what these accelerated frequency might be telling us about human evolutionary change. A 7.83 Hz frequency is the alpha theta state. Relaxed, yet dreamy, sort of a neutral idling state waiting for something to happen. An 8.5 to 16.5 Hz frequency moves one out of the theta range into more of a full calmer alpha state with faster more alert beta frequencies starting to appear. This correlates with slowing, slowly waking up cognitively. Since the Schumann resonance has had sudden spikes between 12 and 60 and a half hertz, and see, you can see the pictures with white areas, I found this even more interesting. In neurofeedback, 12 to 15 hertz is called sensory motor rhythm frequency or SMR. It is an ideal state of awakened calm our thought processes are clearer and more focused, yet we are still in the flow or in the know. In other words, Mother Earth is shifting her vibrational frequency, and perhaps so are we. This may be one of many signs that we are, quote-unquote, awakening. Scientists report that the Earth's magnetic field, which can affect the human resonance, has, has slowly been weakening for the past 2,000 years, and even more so in the last few years. No one really knows why. I was told by a wise old sage from India that the magnetic field of the earth was put in place by the ancient ones to block our primordial memories of our true heritage. This was so that souls could learn from the experience of free will unhampered by memories of the past. He claimed that the magnetic field changes are now loosening those memory blocks and we are raising our consciousness to greater truth. The veil is lifting, the blinders are coming off. If true, it raises even more intriguing questions. Whatever is happening, it's clear that this acceleration may make you feel more tired, exhausted, dizzy, depressed, and even strange as you raise your own frequencies to be more in tune with the new Earth. 
adaptation is not always an easy process, but keep in mind it's all part of your own unique awakening. Dr. Kathy Forty is a clinical psychologist, inventor of the Trinity Aid technology, and author of the book Fractals of God. This is on Humans Are Free. Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. What do you think about this? That is becoming a spiritual awakening.